First at six, we continue working breaking news. Crews are battling a large fire at a Mattapoisett boatyard that's burned several boats, cars, and buildings. Let's get to 12 News reporter Amanda Pitts with an update. Where we are right now is the town beach, but if you look over my shoulder and across the water, you can see firefighters in a ladder truck shooting water on what is the Mattapoisett boat yard, which is just beyond that tree line. Not too long ago, smoke was billowing from those trees, thick black smoke that could be seen for miles. But as you can see now, no more visible smoke as multiple fire departments are here on scene tackling this fire. This all started just before two. Here's a look at the scene a bit earlier. As you can see, multiple vehicles and boats, along with a few buildings, completely destroyed by this massive fire. This is at the Mattapoisett Boat Yard on Ned's Point on Mattapoisett Harbor. According to its website, the boat yard is a family run business dating back to the 1960s. It offers service and repairs to vessels, and locals tell me boats go there to gas up. So we're talking about a lot of fuel in that boat yard. Combine that with the wind here on shore and that fire spread quickly. Here's how residents described the scene this afternoon. We were taking our new puppy out and we saw a huge film of um, black smoke, really, really dark smoke. There was an enormous fire and it was just blowing and blowing because obviously it's so windy out today. Now we are hearing from residents who live in the surrounding neighborhoods around the boat yard. They say firefighters are dousing their homes with water to prevent them from catching fire. Again, it's very windy here on shore and we are in a drought, so firefighters are taking all the precautions they can. Right now, we're unsure if anyone was injured in this boat fire. We are waiting to hear from officials who are obviously very busy right now. When we learn any more information, we'll bring it to you on air and online. For now, in Mattapoisett, Amanda Pitts, 12 News.